Hello my dear friends, welcome to Recycle Bin Tech channel. Today we are going to see Windows update error. In this I have connected my Wi-Fi and uh, just we are going to uh, see here. Let me press the back button and uh, here we, I am going to press the retry button. When I press the retry, we are getting the error message like a 0 into 8007005. So while I'm trying two, three times for re, uh, retry to update, but it's not updating, and uh, there is some issue. For that, we just type services.msc because in this command we are we can change the settings and uh, check the settings in uh, the, if there is any update issue. Just I'm pressing OK, and uh, the screen will appear here. While appearing the screen, we will just scroll down. Uh, it's Windows update Windows it's an W W it will be the last so we will come down while you come down we can see that uh, Windows there is an option Windows update and uh, so in this option there you can find uh, like a disable automatic manual like this it's in disable and I press this automatic uh, delayed or start or whatever it is just I'm pressing automatic or manual while pressing the manual and I give apply, you can see access is denied. Means this has been blocked by somebody, uh, any one of them. So just I'm giving here the OK button. If I give the OK button also, it will be the same option. If I press the automatic and I just give the apply, it will be the same option like access is denied. And uh, you can see the start and stop, pause and resume, the, all the options are disabled. We have to enable these options and I just pressing this OK and the same error message we am getting and I just am closing the screen and uh, let me close this screen also and now we are going to the option it's an regedit R E G E D I T this is the next command just uh, while uh, uh, to open this command you can press the window and R key and now I am giving the option yes and in this uh, option we can see H key local mission just to make it uh, expand and this you will find you will uh, select this option system in this of system we are going to select the option current control set in this current control set and uh, in this option we are going to select services in the services we are uh, we can just uh, scroll down and uh, let me let us see the next option what we are going to uh, see we can to find this option that is a simple method you can op open this one just uh, windows update just uh, double click or open it and in this uh, just manual not not uh, you can see in the top side and uh, w u a u s e r v this is the uh, service service name just uh, let me close this one and you can we can find this uh, wa and it's almost uh, almost it's over here and in this just right click and select the option permission in this you can see full control if you select the full control you can see unable to save the permission and changes access is denied in this we will select the option add in this add we will go for the settings advanced in this advanced we will find the we will uh, select the option find now and in this find now we will select the option everyone you can see you can find this here everyone and give ok while you give ok and from here also you can give the ok and uh, already it has given like a full control and we can find this access is denied same error we are still getting and uh, we had to check this administrator this is the username if we give full control and it's the same error we are getting and we'll go for the advanced settings in this advanced settings we'll find this option everyone and if we go for add and uh, select the principal and in this we'll go for advanced option and the same find now and in this also same we will select everyone you can see here it's everyone and give ok and from here also we can give ok while you give all everything is ok we will find the option full control and read x etc we give ok from there and you can see this everyone it's a full control and the same error we are getting access is denied and in this change settings we'll try one more time same procedure <coughs> 
in this you can see the desktop name whether it's different or it's same it's and same and we'll do one more time same procedure and in this procedure we can select the different uh, like administrator you can see there like a download simple or uh, an arrow mark over there and uh, from here we can change replace the owner and sub contents and objects because sub permissions which will be design uh, denied so while you deny this permission you can enable uh, by while uh, doing this procedure and if i do and you can see enable inheritance inheritance and uh, this this also and uh, option just uh, we can uh, enable it when you enable it will show the option like disable and before the enable and disabling that we had to select it correct user and it's the same you can see over here and just we can give there and uh, you can see it's an everyone from here let us see the option It's in, in a it's enable inheritance and you apply and still we find the same error and we can replace all the child permission like this do you wish to continue if you give x, x okay then also same error let us check uh, from this place in the advanced and same administrator and it's already it's coming like full control and we already we have uh, uh, enabled that uh, inheritance and we we'll, we find the same error let us check one more time we'll give the option yes access is denied and same and while uh, enabling this option you can see everything i will show you one more time that's you can go to the change option and they find now in this you will find access control administrator and administrators there is three option we will find the third option we will select the third option already i had said you we have to select the different uh, administrator like this if you find if you select the third option you will find all this option it will be enabled you can see that's everyone system administrator user user etc and you, here also you can see all our application package and everything account own like a creator owner and every, everything the third administrator it was being blocked so i have select the third administrator and everything is in enable and you can give the option okay from there and uh, and this and this place also you can give full control and give okay after that now just uh, we close the screen and uh, from here we will change and see whether it has been enabled or disabled we will click the double click over here and just click over here and we will select automatic or manual and i selected uh, just manual and you will give apply while we give apply you can see now it has been changed now we will uh, we'll start the option you can see this options has been enabled and stop option also enabled and uh, we are just uh, you can see this option is running and now we will uh, retry this option you can see now it's checking for new updates we had to wait for a little time because uh, maybe this update has been blocked for uh, like a uh, maybe one month or two months and you will find a uh, like a uh, more update on this and we can just check uh, in this manage because there is anything uh, still pending to uh, like uh, update like a uh, drivers for a uh, video uh, video card or uh, usb or whatever it is so this is the simple method you can solve this issue if you like the video please subscribe and support thank you for watching my video we'll see you on the next video bye bye and see you